You guys might see right here, there's a, a sign that says, no gods, no masters. That's not a coincidence. Margaret Sanger's first published piece in a, in a, a paper called Woman Rebel had the tagline under that paper, no gods and no masters. That was the tagline of Margaret Sanger's first pen to paper published pieces in about the uh, 1915, 1914 time frame. And you'll see it right here. It says no gods, no masters, no Nazis, no fascists, which is actually fascinating because not only was Margaret Sanger hobnobbing with many Nazi sympathizers, but some of them were on her board of directors. And of course, Margaret Sanger was the founder of Planned Parenthood, right? She had a board member who did a journalistic speech speaking tour in Nazi Germany and met with Adolf Hitler and other Nazi party leaders. Her board member's name was Lothrop Stoddard and he wrote a book called The Rise of the Underman and the Nazis got the German term Untermensch or subhuman to describe the Jews from the English version of Margaret Sanger's board member's book. And uh, she hobnobbed with the American Eugenics Society, who were very influential in influencing Hitler and much of the eugenic Nazi policies that would be on the books in Germany. So it's just fascinating. This no gods, no masters sign is a reference to Margaret Sanger, who was not only a, a Nazi sympathizer, but was actually an influence upon the very policies that would be enshrined in Nazi Germany. Uh, but again, you can't expect these people to think for themselves.